Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another Taste Test Tuesday here at Big John TV. What we're all about? Food, food, food. That's how we're all. Thanks for tuning in. If you like to find new foods to try, right? Yep. Limited edition, seasonal trending, things that grab our attention while we're grocery shopping. Yeah. Now this is a new release item from Mountain Dew, so you know we are all over it. Now. This one's a weird one. It's a weird one, and one we've done partially before. Uh, last year, or two years ago, I can't remember the time frames now. The past couple years have just been a blur. Um, Mountain Dew has released a flaming Hot flavor before. Mm -hmm. And we got it, and we tried it. Do you remember that one? No. It was in cans. Yeah, yeah, I remember. And it was only open for sale for a little bit of time, and then they sold out. And that was it. That was done. They're never coming back. Yeah. Well, now they've released to the masses a different version. It's still flaming Hot, but it comes with the extra lime flavor can you see mm. well, extra mm. lime liminess so this is a flaming hot mountain dew and they are featuring a lime flavor with it as well is it? the last one did not have the lime it just was the flaming hot i'm looking at it okay it's a cool color yeah. you got the cool artwork yeah. right um, I always love the bottles. I love the textures. Yeah, there it is. that is a cool thing, too. Uh, caution, Flamin' Hot, Mountain Dew. Dew with the blast of heat and citrus. And like I said, it is specifically featuring a lime in the artwork, whereas the last Mountain Dew Flamin' Hot did not. So that's the difference between now and then. And I got my tiny glass from Vegas. The soda cup. The soda cup for all of our videos, huh? Yeah, for all of the soda. All right, here we go. <clears throat> don't you're shaking the camera now. My bad. Um, don't act like that spicy. Well, it is. No. Yeah. Okay. It tickles the back of the throat a little bit. No, a lot. You say that's spicy? Yeah. Oh, I just don't know. You may have to call it a second kid opinion. Maddie! What? Come in and join us real quick on this one. We're rolling now. Jamie says it's actually spicy. I want to know what you think. Do you want to look up too or do you want to use the, the bottle? I'll just drink up the bottle. Make sure you're on. Yes. Do you remember the last one? It's not spicy. He was like, I'm it's like. It's a little like peppery, like a little. Okay, so up front I'm getting citrus. I'm almost regular Mountain Dew, because Mountain Dew is very citrusy anyway. That's actually really good. And then at the very back end when you swallow. Creeps back up. It's almost like a cinnamon heat to me. Yeah. Hmm. So, scale of 1 to 10, how spicy would you say this is? 2. 0. I'm out. That's wow. it. No. Only 2. What, 2? Okay. I'm going to go with I 0. Only, I could taste it, but I wouldn't give it like a high score. Okay. But it made you go, <laughs> was that just because you were confused or because it was actually spicy? That's the thing. Both. Okay. Um... I'm going to give it a zero on spice, even though it does tickle the throat. It's not actually a heat. It's just like it's there. It gets you. Like I said, it is almost a cinnamony kind of a burn, Yeah. which is a little bit different. Don't probably wouldn't get it in your eye. No, definitely don't. That's going to burn. So if you use the store locator feature on the website, uh, Mountain Dew, probably what, MountainDew.com, um, you type in your zip code and which kind, of, what soda you're looking for. It'll tell you where you can find these in your area. We haven't been able to find them at big chains or Walmart yet, but oddly enough, all the like liquor store, gas station, quick stops Have are it. carrying these in our area. So if you want to find them, you're going to have to do a little bit of work and go to the store locator app or feature on the website, um, track it down. I think it's good. I think it's fun. I think it's kitschy. Is it really truly flaming hot? No. Is it really truly a spicy drink? Yeah, a little bit. Okay, we'll give we'll say a little bit. You know, is it a chili heads? No. Fantasy drink that's gonna burn your mouth off while you're drinking it? No. No. Is it a little bit different than a regular Mountain Dew? Yes. Yes. 
Is it fun and different? Yes. Yes. So Are you waiting for me to say yes? Because uh, you're helping me along. <laughs> yes. And it's caffe it's uh, Mountain Dew, so it's caffeinated. So there you go. That's the review. I think it's fun. I think it's good. You should try chugging mm -hmm. this one. Um, no thank you. <laughs> I'm good. Um, thanks for the suggestion, though. Appreciate it. Should. it. No thanks. It would be hard. Do you think it would be? If you drink all of that, I bet you would get that spice. No. No. I'm just kidding. What do you, what do you think? Do it. We have an, two bottles. We did buy two. Say, ooh. <laughs> um, it does do a little bit more if you drink the whole, almost the whole bottle in one shot. It's, uh, it's. <laughs> I, uh, I might. T I like that you find so much humor in this. Um, I'm maybe a one, maybe a two. Oh, what? Like, <laughs> I, I feel it definitely more than just the sip. Definitely strong in that citrus flavor. It's tickling the back of the throat. It's getting me in my, the back of my nostrils. I can, I can smell it. I can feel it in my, in my sinuses. Is it super crazy? No. S screaming hot? No. Unless you're not, like, that good at spice, I bet you... Like if you oh, like, I tell you, if you like new to spice and stuff, I bet you this. You um, not like this. the burps are a little bit violent. Yeah. That burned a little bit. Yeah. All right, Jamie. Well, way to salvage this quick, easy video and turn it into a chug challenge as I well. Like <laughs> <laughs> well done. Well done. Well, so I'd still buy it. There you go. Go get you some. I'm Mountain Dew, flaming hot. Thanks for watching. We're not, you guys say goodbye on all the social media stuff, right? Like, subscribe, share with your friends. You can find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. There we go. Make sure you ring the notification bell so you can get notified when we post all our YouTube videos. Now I have to open the other one for a TikTok video because there's none left here. Oh, true. Dang it. All right. See you guys. Bye. Bye.